The Ministry of Labor is set to undertake rigorous training on digital literacy for young people to boost their employability in global market. Skills Development Secretary Dr. Wanjiru Karyoki says a policy framework on career guidance and national skills is set to be rolled out in the coming months to develop the skills of young people. The digital skills gap represents a major challenge slowing down the digital transformation of the Kenyan economy. This shortfall harms business competitiveness and productivity as the number of workers with tech skill does not match existing digital economy needs. The Ministry of Labor is urging young Kenyans to master digital skills such as coding, digital marketing, graphic design, and e-commerce to tap into a wide range of online opportunities including freelancing, starting online businesses, and participating in the global digital marketplace. We're going to get all these jobs in the, in the, in the ICT sector. We want to spur innovation in agriculture. We want to spur innovation in health. We want to inspire innovation in, in uh, in, in manufacturing, we want to inspire innovation in energy, and this is the power of tra digital transformation because it's going to create a sufficient uh, opportunity across all sectors, and therefore jobs are likely to be to be not likely actually jobs will be created as a result of this massive transformation that's being driven by digital economy. However. The government is poised to introduce a comprehensive policy on career guidance in national skills policy in a move geared towards equipping the youth with the skills needed to drive in the international labor market. National skills development policy, this one was approved by cabinet on 13th December 2023. And uh, this particular policy is addressing the skills mismatch and is, is trying to address uh, how education and training can align their programs to the demands of the labor market. Uh, so we have quite a number of um, policy priority actions in that policy, and we believe this one will address the skills mismatch. Furthermore, the state seeks to collaborate with private sector players, educational institutions, and non-profit organizations to expand access to digital skills training across the country. Our programs, our courses, the ones that we are providing in, uh, in the Gig Economy Initiative, they are open for everyone. So they are, um, they are free of charge and they are self-paced. So everyone, wherever they are, uh, as long as they have an internet connection, they can basically take those courses. So that's how we account for that. Um, and we definitely try to get involved as many people as possible, including underprivileged people or, or neglected uh, groups. Kenya is hosting the Future of Work Summit at the University of Nairobi, which provides captains of the industry with a platform to discuss strategies for preparing the workforce for the evolving digital landscape. Frederick Mwoki for Prime Edition.